So let's talk about memberships. I previously released a video called Won't You Be My Neighbor? And I am now realizing the failure in releasing that video. Most of you responded positively to that, but I realized that most of you also don't understand the full context of why I said that. And that's something I wanna explain here now. So seven, eight years ago, really going all the way back to the beginning of my channel, I would get thousands of comments from people saying things like, I wish you were my neighbor. In fact, I got so many of those comments, I responded to it in a video and I said, man, you know, I'm, I'm honored that you guys feel that way and you are like my neighbors. So you can think of my videos as my way of inviting you over to my home, inviting my neighbors over. And that was a theme for a long time on my channel. So when I was making my video and thinking about this community within a community, I thought my neighborhood, my neighbors, and all of those memories and thoughts came flooding back about talking with people about being my neighbor. Uh, unfortunately, over the last two years or so, I have barely mentioned it in videos, but also in the last two years, I have hundreds of thousands of new subscribers and surely I've lost some of the old ones. And so most of you watching that video didn't really have any context for what I really meant by neighbor. I didn't realize that that was sort of an inside joke with uh, too many outsiders. All of you new people here, I wanna apologize. It didn't, it didn't make sense to you and so it felt really out of context. So let me try again to explain what I'm trying to do with memberships. And that is memberships are about giving you more. For years I have seen this need for mentorship, for people who, are, who want to ask questions, they wanna see how the sauces may go behind the scenes, they want to know more about my projects. They want to ask questions about their projects. And this is all stuff, there's a theme. I'm seeing a lot of the same questions over and over, but these aren't things that are interesting enough to appeal to everyone. What I have is this niche community of tinkerers and makers and people who are interested in seeing more stuff, but there isn't enough aggregate demand uh, to make that into full YouTube videos. So how do I make stuff for them, for that group? I want to do it, but there isn't enough interest to fund those kinds of videos. And then memberships came along and that's what I'm trying to do. I wanna offer you more access, more content. I wanna offer you a community of makers and tinkers where we can talk with each other, we can ask questions. And because you have more access, like you'll be able to participate in member only live streams, you have an opportunity to influence the direction of the main content, right? You can suggest ideas and things like that. So again, you guys are smart, you understand what I'm trying to do. The stuff that I make on my regular channel now uh, is taking care of itself. And if you enjoy my content, you don't need to become a member to continue to enjoy the content that I make now. That stuff will stay exactly the same. If you want more, if you wanna have a little Jarvis icon next to your name so that when you leave a comment, it's highlighted for me and I can prioritize them because I have to do that now, but it's more arbitrary because I can't answer them all, the members' comments will be elevated and I can respond to them first. It's just, again, a logistical problem and you guys can understand that. You're smart, come on. So hopefully that clears things up. This is something I'm really excited about. I'm also really excited about seeing how you interact with each other. You guys have a lot of experience and you can be trying projects that others haven't tried, using tools and things that others haven't used. And there's a shared learning that will happen down in the comments and in our discussions as we talk about these various projects, both your projects and mine. And a quick note for my patrons, if you are a current patron, you will have access to all the same stuff. Any videos that I post for my members will also be posted on Patreon so that you can watch that content there. And I will also give you direct access to the live streams that go up. Unfortunately, there are some perks that I can't share with my patrons. For example, you won't have the little Jarvis icon next to your name. And there are some custom emojis that are available to members that I won't be able to share with uh, my patrons. So if those features are important to you, then you may wanna consider getting a membership or switching or whatever you wanna do, but it's not required. You'll still have access to the videos and as much of the content as I can share, I wanna share that with you as well. Now it's likely that these perks will slightly change and improve over time. So rather than try to list them all in this video, I'm just gonna ask you to click the join button and you can see all the perks that are available when you become a member. If you want more access and more narrow content that's specifically focused on makers and tinkers, there's just some niche stuff that's not great for everyone, but it's great for a smaller crowd, that's the group that I wanna to talk to. And that content will be for you. And you're also welcome to continue to enjoy the content I make for you now. Whether you become a member or not, 
it won't change a thing. And if you happen to be one of my neighbors from way back in the day, <laughs> please come down in the comments and let me know that you're still here. I would love to hear from you, neighbor. All right, bye for now.